Yo, what's going on guys, I'm Nick Slivery and today we have another Clash Royale video. Now, I know I haven't uploaded in a while, but, you know, here's a quick video for you. Uh, here's another battle deck I have come up with. Now, I have to give credit to my clan leader, Josh, because uh, he kind of used this deck on me the other day. Uh, he hasn't got it on anymore, but, well, I did slightly change it a bit. He used some else for the wizard and so on. Um... I have only just changed his deck uh, with the fire spirits. I was using the spear goblins, but either works fine, really. Uh, and I know there is an update coming out tomorrow. The uh, fire spirits are actually the area damage radius is being increased by 25%, and the cannon hit points are being decreased by 5%. But that ain't a major update for this deck, really. Everything else is staying the same. Oh, and the royal giants uh, damage is decreasing by 4%, but. Never mind, it's one of them, and it, it's still going to work perfectly fine now. I don't know what I was on before now. My highest trophies was 2426, but I let this guy at my work play. I don't know why I did, and he actually just made me lose loads. Like, if I go down here a second, no, you'll see defeat, 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 draw, defeat, draw, defeat. <laughs> so, you know, uh, I did have a load of trophies before, like a load of victories, uh, and... After I got it back, I've got four victories on the trot and a draw, unfortunately. But a draw is still good because you don't lose, you don't win. It's fine. You move on. So anyway, this deck does work really well. I uh, have been using it for the past few days. Now, let's go ahead and pick a game. I'll pick this one. I don't really know what it is, but I'll pick this one. So, let me move this over here. So, basically... It's a low elixir deck, which is really good, because you can count pretty much anything. Now, at the start of the game, obviously, I like to wait for them to place things down. Or if I have the cannon, I'll put that down. And I put that cannon on the wrong side for some reason. Never mind. Uh, now, I'm going to quickly put the fire ball straight over there. Try and take out... I did take out one minion, which isn't too bad. Minion's in a major problem. Uh, he's down, now putting down a Valkyrie, so I'm just going to put down mine. At the start of the game... What you got to think about is, like now, I knew his elixir count was lower than mine. All I had to do was counter his attack and have people standing so I could then counter attack stronger. And yeah, he did play very well there, um, I have to admit. So now I'm going to try go for, I think I'll go for a barbarian royal joint attack, I think. <laughs> But anyway, the main purpose of this strategy and this battle deck is to use the Royal Giant to take him out because he is quite overpowered, to be honest. Um, his range and everything is just spectacular. His hit points, you just can't knock him, to be honest. Now, what you've got to look for is a breakthrough. What I mean by that is... If you have a Royal Joint and a Wizard and you know they have a Minion Horde, if you put down the Royal Joint first, the chances are if they have the Minion Horde, they're going to put it down, uh, which I found out. So you want to put the Wizard behind him, but not straight away. You want to put the Wizard down once the Royal Joint has passed the bridge, so they have time to put theirs down, and by the time they've put theirs down, and you put your Wizard down, it's too late for them, and you know you've got them. Uh... Right now, I'm going for the left side attack because, or not. <laughs> uh, basically, I know we had that Inferno Tower. I was just trying to distract as much as I could, say, like, putting Barbarians in front of it. Now, I did do very well. And right here, he messed up because he puts the Valkyrie on the left side. I don't know why. And then he messed up again by putting his Royal Giant on the right side because I've took out his tower on the right side. Now, I know he's most likely going to take that tower out. Like with the hit points that's going to be left, 702 isn't a lot of hit points, and I know he's probably and me carrying that Valkyrie on the left and still having a full team standing and a Royal Giant coming up. He puts the Valkyrie on the right. I know if he, even if he uses that tower on the right now, he's, there's no chance he can win. Or if I take out that tower on the left, there's no chance he can win, even if he puts that tower down. So there you have it. You've got to play kind of strategical, I suppose. Like, you've still got to kind of think of what you're doing. But at the same time, it's really easy to do. This battle deck, I have to say, is the most efficient battle deck I've uploaded to date. 
if you've got the cards which you should have then exactly amazing cards like there's one two three four five commons i don't even know why i had to count that then but never mind and three rares i'm not using any legendaries most people have the wizard and the fireball and a valkyrie that's just standard they just come like as easy cards uh i still i'm kind of pissed look I, I don't how come i haven't got none of the hidden cards like the uh, legendary cards that, that, that i find that quite offensive <laughs> And I've actually won, like, well, I've opened, well, I've bought a few Super Magic or Magical chests, and as you've seen on my channel, and I don't know, they're just not giving me them. So, anyway, uh, that being said, I'm getting my Barbarians to level 10, that's why I'm not upgrading, but, um, yeah, if you like the deck, please let me know, um, if I find a better deck than this, which, to be honest, at the moment, I don't think you will do. This, to me, well, as you can see, victories all round obviously the defeat sent me uh, and then back here i get victory 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 defeat never mind uh you've got to lose some <laughs> but yeah as you can see my trophies are a major boost as well like my all-time best before i put this deck on was 310 or 309 now look like i'm killing it plus all the defeats i had before you can tell it works so anyway guys if you like the battle deck do try it out and i will see you in the next video